Breaking Pipe News. Oh, hey there, YouTubers. Uh, <clears throat> how's it going? Just figured I'd... Oh, oh, my God. Oh, 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 oh. Eh, screw it. Um, just thought I'd check in and say hi. Uh, talking to Big Papa Mike on uh, Skype this morning. And uh, we're talking about some uh, <laughs> kind of funny things. Um, talking about the whole... Uh, you know, controversy stuff that we were talking about. Um, Jay made a video, Tom made a video, and I myself made a video, and we came up with a solution. We have decided that the best way to deal with this problem is to buy a ton of tobacco so that if it became outlawed, we could all have our own secret cellars and smoke tobacco for like 20 years without having to get any more. Um, that is the, the best way we can do it. So... If we all buy so much tobacco that we literally have an entire cellar full, then maybe, maybe the problem won't matter. And for those guys that can't afford it, we'll find guys that can afford it and they'll help them out. You know, bring the community together, you know, stuff like that. It'll be nice. It'll be real nice. Now, Mike brought up a question to me earlier. And he was wondering, let me see if I can find it on the Skype chat here. Um, he was wondering if I found myself addicted to the tobacco. Um, I guess he was, he went somewhere the other day and uh, didn't bring his pipe and he was, he was wanting one pretty bad. Now, this makes me think, we sit here, or go wherever we go, with a pipe, clenching our jaw, smoking. For how many hours a day? <clears throat> how many hours a week? <clears throat> I think that might be the thing. Um, a lot of uh, people that I know that have tried to quit sm uh, smoking recently have had problems quitting because they just they need that you know just that the hand movement. People are just used to that. It's like a, a muscle reflex. Maybe it's a muscle reflex with the pipe as well. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Now, I forgot to do this, but I will do it now. The housekeeping. One of my cheap Italians. Just stay, uh, you know, hope you can see that. Uh, with my classically tempting mix in here. Which, uh, it's pretty light, I think. Um, I think it's a pretty light blend. Um, which is, it's good for the mornings, I think. Because uh, I don't want anything too harsh or too heavy or, you know. Um, might, uh, might bother me a bit, my fancy mug. Ugh. But uh, I think that along with our, you know, needing to have the, the pipe with us and the, the, you know, it's not necessarily a craving or an addiction. Um, it's more of a, uh, it's, I likened it to if I'm with my girlfriend for, you know, say a few days you know, non-stop, and all of a sudden she's gone, I miss her like crazy. And so, I think that it's the same thing. When you have a pipe all the time, and it's always on you, and you're always clenching your jaw, walking around like this, you know, lighting, smoking, camping, you know, that kind of a thing. It's the smell, it's the, you know, the feel, the taste, the everything. I think that is what makes me crave it. And I think that might also be why Mike would crave it, too. Uh, Big Papa Mike. But it uh, makes me wonder. I, really make, I have to keep laying this. I don't think I uh, packed it very well. Um, and I'm also not really smoking it very much. But uh, I think I've had this pipe for about an hour now, and I'm barely through it. Excuse me. Um... So, I fixed our problem with uh, if tobacco got outlawed. I figured out that pipe smoking, you don't get addicted to it, but you miss it and you crave it, just like, a, you know, you miss it like a girlfriend. Um, you, your body gets used to it being there. Especially, I think, if you smoke more, like if you smoke, say, six to eight pipes a day, um, 
I smoke one to two. Uh, it's not as bad, but sometimes I do get that feeling. Um, I'll be playing video games or something like that, and I'll be like, I really want a pipe right now. Um, but uh, I don't know. I usually like them when I work. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think. I I'm curious to know what you guys think about this. Um, these two, uh, the solution, and then the uh, uh, concept of missing your pipe. Um, <clears throat> whether you feel like you're addicted or not. You should let me know. Leave a reply, make a video, um, respond to it. Let me know that you responded to it. Um, and uh, let's, uh, let's talk about this. I'm curious. I'm curious now. But um, also, we were talking about uh, tobacco and how um, I don't have much. I've only, I think I've only smoked maybe three blends ever. Um, Currently, I have a lot in the little box um, that I have that I showed you, um, but I want, I have to wait until I get my own apartment so then I can try to, you know, um, rehydrate it a bit so I can smoke it. Um, all of them are, are, you know, a little dry because they're in the plastic bags. Um, I'm sorry, my hair is like really ridiculously crazy right now, um, but uh, it's 11 o'clock <laughs> and I look like I just got out of bed. Uh... But I think that I, I want to get more blends, and I'm the kind of I'm the kind of guy that likes a stockpile. So if I had, you know, an entire cellar full, um, I've seen pictures of people that have entire cellars full. It's crazy, absolutely crazy. Um, wow, I'm already at seven minutes. Um, but it'd be cool just to have a somewhat decent stockpile. I like I like how Jay's collection is. He's got you know that like little wall where he's got all of his different blends and everything else, and I think that's, that's like the perfect collection to me. I feel like that's, I wouldn't want too much more than that. I'd have my favorite blend stockpiled, um, like, you know, maybe three, four tins, or if I bought bulk and just have a jar, a big old jar of them. <clears throat> but uh, I like Jay's collection when he showed us. Um, I literally have one small jar and two tins, or three tins, I'm sorry, I've, I've tried th uh, four tobaccos my entire life, unless you count the blend as two because technically it's two tobaccos blended together. Um, so whatever, anywhere from four to five um, blends. I was wrong. I'm sorry. I apologize. Um, but I have the University Flake as well, which I I did like. It smokes very, 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 very long. Um, but anyway, I ramble. I feel like Jay. I'm sorry. No offense to you, Jay. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a rambler as well, so don't worry about it. Um, but let me know what you think. Uh, how do you feel about stockpiling? Do you think you can keep a stockpile? Um, or do you smoke that much that you would go through it faster? Uh, and maybe you would just need more. Um, but I think, I think our solution to this problem is to get everyone to have a massive stockpile. Or if we could set up an underground group where every couple states has one massive stockpile. Um, anyway, I'm thinking, this, I'm thinking into this too much. Um, but uh, if anyone could stockpile, I think that would be a good idea. Yeah, a really good idea. Let me know what you think. And uh, how you feel about the, the pipe like a girlfriend thing. Alright, I'm going to get out of here. You guys have a good day. Uh, I'll probably make another video coming up shortly, maybe today or tomorrow, I don't know, we'll see. Anyway, I'm gonna play with, uh, with some, uh, iMovie, so. See you later. Have a good day. Bye, everybody. Smoke strong.